What makes you smile? This article was born this morning, as I drove down a usually busy road, which today was virtually void of cars. The sun was shining, the trees were fresh, after yesterday's downpour. All felt great with my world. I have that everything is great kind of smile on my face. Yes, I could be worrying about the rest of the world, Ebola, wars, earthquakes, but sometimes you have to live for the moment and enjoy the what you have. I can't alter the world catastrophes. There is a saying which, in essence, says, change what you can and learn to accept what you can. Things that generally make me smile. Little children playing happily and the funny things they say. Beauty in nature like sunsets, I'm not usually up for sunrise, but I'm sure that would give me a contented smile too. Waves on hot sand, oh there are too many to mention, but it does us good to spend a moment dwelling on them. Now for work-related things that make me smile, I love the peace of working at home, or on the river bank, or on the beach writing short articles for my business. It is the freedom and autonomy of being my own boss, so that I can choose to work when and where I like, fitting in computer work and other tasks when it suits me. Yes, of course there is work involved if you want to pay the bills, but doing what you love doesn't feel like hard work. What makes you smile? Are you happy in your chosen work? Do you love sport? Maybe swim in your spare time to unwind or go to the gym? Or do you spend time picnicking and taking long walks with your family? Let go of stress and enjoy the simple things in life. You will feel much more like smiling. Start now and build a hobby business that can provide you with an early retirement. I was amazed to find 375 million people have typed into Google. I want to work at home on my computer. What an unbelievable number, what a lot of people not happy with what they are doing. Is it the long days and hours of commuting, the lack of suitable jobs, frustration with work colleagues, or bosses, or the general rush and hurry of today's lifestyle? I wonder if the number is mostly made up of moms trying to work around family ties, or men feeling overstretched, or retirees subsidizing pensions. If you are one of those people wanting to work at home on your computer, consider starting now as a hobby business. There are hundreds of things you can do if you take the plunge. Or do it a guide to living your dreams by John Roger and Peter McWilliams. Start googling some ideas for starting a business or look at the loads of ideas on YouTube. There are plenty of training videos for internet marketing. Whatever you choose, make it your choice and not what someone else wants you to do. If you cannot decide and find it hard to make decisions, take a sheet of paper, make a for and against column and fill the paper with as many thoughts as you can. Then go back and rate them with a star rating according to your gut feeling. Read the list later and change anything, but you should. Find this helps with clear thinking instead of tumbling ideas in your mind for days. Try it, it works for me. Well wishing you many smiles for the future, reduced stress, and that good to be alive feeling.